Wentworth, imagine this. A car with all the wheels falling off all at once. That's Narconon. What the heck is going on with Narconon? Narconon's being sued about every 10 minutes these days. At this point, I'm going to need several drinks and to check in to Narconon. <laughs> oh my god, no kidding. The client doesn't understand that when they uh, make an argument that someone's stealing their technology, yeah. that's all well and good. But then on the other hand, they're stealing technology and making claims and credentials that they don't have. Oh, that lawsuit. You know, this is the thing I found out. Narconon is stealing drug counselor certifications, using them without actually earning them. That's what I'm talking about. So it's hard for them to then, on the other hand, claim that Mr. Rathbun is stealing all their ideas and their mumbo-jumbo. Oh, yeah. So, so if I steal your drug counselor certifications, I really don't have a right to complain if you steal my religious technology. Exactly. Oh, man. Well, you know, there's one thing they can't steal is a law degree. We got those. For the time being, anyway. <laughs> until they fly us with niacin and lock us in a room. <laughs> well... That's the good thing, is they can't lock us in a room in a security check. We're not members of the Church of Scientology. But this Narconon thing, we are circling the drain. You know, in Georgia, I advised them to give up their license rather than face criminal charges. I think they shut down completely, didn't they? Yep, they did, and uh, it doesn't look good out west. It doesn't look good in East Oklahoma. They are suing, what do we have on that, 82 named defendants? Something like that, and they've got a new federal lawsuit in Nevada every week. There's some uh, character out there filing lawsuit after lawsuit. Hamilton guy? Federal court. He thinks he's some hotshot lawyer, but getting back to this thing with 82 named defendants, I added it up, and the good news for us is we'll have to hire about 100 lawyers. The billings, Wentworth, the billings will go through the roof. Hey, our stats will be straight up at vertical here at We Fucked Him In Hell. <laughs> Especially if they each have a conflict with each other, then they're all going to need separate counsel. Oh, that's what I said. It's about 100 lawyers plus experts. Now, my only concern, what if one of these people being sued, these Narconon drug counselors, <laughs> uh, flips, I it mean... Do we have some risks there? We do, but we also have an advantage. Remember, most of these drug counselors have an unsavory and unseemly background themselves. Well, yeah, that's why they're working for Narconon, but I digress. So if we can keep all the, all the cattle in the pen and get 100 lawyers, I can get a new yacht this year. Didn't you have your eye on that 60-foot one? Yeah, my old yacht's only a 52-footer. It's kind of... Downstep, but that's why the good news is the Church of Scientology is being sued. Yes. It's bad news for them, but good news for us. Speaking of the cattle in the pen, yeah. really if one of those cattle starts to stray away from the flock, as it were, yeah. we just use a cattle prod and zap them a little. <laughs> remind them of their unsavory past. Bring them back into the fold. Well, these are devious characters. I don't have the total of lawsuits, but it's a lot. And it seems like... Every day when I, I get on the internet and log on to that uh, Tony Ortega site, he's posted another lawsuit. I think what we're going to have to do is set up a separate division at We Fuck Him and How called Narconon Lawsuits. I think we're going to have to actually staff a whole new department. And I'm worried about it turning into a class action. Do you see a risk there? Uh, I do, but... I'm more intrigued by the fact that we're billing the client for going on Tony Ortega's website and reading about it. There's nothing juicier than billing for reading what they call that N theta business. Oh, I make a lot of money reading N theta. And then I digest it all into a daily briefing for Mr. Miscavige. And what I say is, Mr. Miscavige, it's so dangerous out there without us that we fuck him and how protecting you. 
We need some more money, sir, to keep you safe from this very dangerous environment. Give him the idea of circling the wagons around oh, the home base. We're so indispensable, Wentworth. I've made lawyers so indispensable that it's his only salvation. Isn't that ironic, Wentworth, that he's running a church of Scientology to offer salvation, and yet we, WAG lawyers, are his salvation. I like how this is working for us. It makes me feel good about having went to law school. How about you? It's delicious.